Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Habakkuk those that are the names of the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, who the word ignorantly called God in Jesus Christ, whose correct and proper names are Yahweh and Yahweh Shai. In the name of the Holy Spirit, I would also like to give a double honors unto my apostles and elders of great millstone that have taught me this truth. And I would like to say a sincere shalom unto the hopeful elect that are scattered throughout the four winds of the world, unto the servants, the prophets, the men that are laboring and prophesying in this truth. To you, I say shalom. None of the wicked shall understand. All right. And the wicked is talking about Esau, Edom, the so-called white man. But also the wicked is referring to two thirds of our own people. That won't understand this truth. That just won't get it. All right. That that you know that that the, the ways, the philosophies of America, the this Westernized way of living is really seared into their brains, where they can't get it. They can't understand the truth. However way you try to break it down, they can't get it. So, you know, hey, they hey, you're gonna have to just you know if you got family members, uh, 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 aunts, uncles, whoever that that you know or that are in the world that are that are lost. You just got to pray that the Heavenly Father opens their eyes because it's up to the Lord to it's up to the Lord to open their eyes for them to get it. OK, and, and the men of the Lord, the prophets are, are out here to warn our people to um, let them know the times that were coming in, the prophecies. All right. Let our people know that there is Israelites. But if you can't get it, if you can't receive it, hey, you got to move on. All right. Whether it's your mom, whether it's your dad, it could be your kids. All right. They're not going to get it. All right. They're not going to get it until. They dealing with prophecy right in their face, and for a lot of them, it's going to be too late. Okay, because the wicked, the, the Edomites, they it's not given to them to understand. All right, but our people, it's given to. All right, our people should be the first ones to try to uh, um to get this, and who 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 and our people are the ones that's going to receive this, the elect. But all of all Israelites should be trying to um receive this knowledge. Okay. So let me start with uh, Daniel 12 and verse 10. Many shall be purified and made white and tried. That's speaking of the elect. All right. Those that who have eyes to see who the heavenly father has opened their eyes to this truth and to this knowledge. OK, but the wicked shall do wickedly. All right. Like I said, it, um, it's talking about the wicked who was the uh, so-called white man Esau Edom. All right. They, they're not going to understand this truth. All right. Because th these mysteries weren't given to them. All right. But. Is also referring to the wicked of our people, all right. That 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 scoff at the truth, okay. That 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 make mockery, all right. That 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 sit up there and talk shit, all right. They they talk shit because they they really the heavenly father is not dealing with them. They were pretty much born in vain. They have to they're going to have to learn through death by pain, all right. And, and it's and not all of them that don't understand the truth may not be completely wicked but it's some guile is something in them that the heavenly father is not allowing them to open their eyes completely to see this truth all right because you know everyone that you you figure that can't get this truth they not be may not be overly wicked but it's something in them okay that the heavenly father is is, is not is not you know is not giving them um uh, uh giving them eyes to see it's, it's not giving them the 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 full understanding the, the, to, to understand this truth all right. But the wicked shall do wickedly and none of the wicked shall understand. But the wise shall understand. And that wise is speaking of the elect. But the wicked won't understand. The wicked are not going to get it. All right. So stop. You know, you 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 jakes out there, you know, that understand this truth. Hey, you tell your family member once, maybe twice. That's it. They're not going to get it. All right. They, 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 they you know, they're not going to get it. You know, and, and I had to I had to deal with the same thing um, in my walk. All right. Hey, you try to tell family, you know, you think they're going to get it. They see the pandemic. They see these things happening. They're not going to get it. All right. Because they, their mind is still stuck and their heart is really in America. All right. The, you know, the, these niggas really love America. OK, they they love the, the, the you know, the, the just the wicked, the wickedness that, that America um, promotes. All right. Even though they may not openly confess it, but they do. OK, because the, the shit that goes on in America, they're not calling it out. They, they don't they don't see a problem with it. OK, all the all this wickedness that goes on in America daily or all the shit that we see on TV or, or the news that they, they are, are people mainly. They, they 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 don't see a problem with it. They're going along to get along. They're still trying to make it because this wisdom, this true wisdom, these mysteries 
will not dwell in a malicious soul like the scripture I'm about to read. This is wisdom of Solomon 1 and 4. For in, for into a malicious soul, wisdom shall not enter, nor dwell in a body that is subject unto sin. Hey, these, Like I said, these people that can't understand this truth, all right, they may not be overly wicked because we're all wicked. We all were wicked at one point, all right? And, we, and, 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 you know, we're still, we're not perfect. All right, I'm not perfect. I'm, I'm trying every day to try to, you know, um, further myself in this truth and, and build in the spirit and, and build my faith and, and, and repent for my sins. No one's no one's perfect. Only one of us perfect was Yahweh Shai. But at the same time, you have to strive to be perfect. Like until uh, like like the scripture says, like Yahweh Shai said, uh, be perfect like like your father is in that uh, is in heaven. You know, roughly paraphrasing. OK, so none of us are perfect, but, you know, the Lord has chosen men to push his word. All right. To that, that the Lord has opened up these mysteries unto men, um, you know, uh, uh, men that are um, were called and hopefully they're chosen to um, to to give it, the children of Israel, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, this truth. OK, but the, hey, if, if your wisdom, excuse me, if you're if you're wicked, this wisdom won't dwell in you. All right, for the Holy Spirit of discipline will flee from deceit and remove from the thoughts that are without understanding and will not abide when unrighteousness cometh in. All right, so the Holy Spirit, these, these, these niggas in the church, they don't got the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is the understanding of the scriptures. When you read something, all right, you could, hey, it's niggas that's been in the prison, in the penitentiary, been in and out, read the Bible back and forth. They can't, they can't understand the Bible because the Holy Spirit is not dealing with them. All right, the Holy Spirit is is, is is not open their eyes to understand what these things mean. All right, but we're living in the last days where the Holy Spirit is dwelling with men, is dwelling with Israelites. All right, and, and, and Israelite men that that are, that are here to tell our people to get right, turn to the Heavenly Father with the with the proper names of the Heavenly Father and His Son. All right, but if you if you you have any guile, if you're malicious, all right, if you're wicked, the Spirit, the Holy Spirit won't dwell with you. All right, point blank, period. OK, because there's a lot of jakes out there that, you know, at least from 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 my standpoint, there's a lot of jakes that I thought that were smart in this world that, you know, they they you know, they I thought they knew some, not necessarily knew something, but I just thought that they were somewhat intelligent. And you tell them about this truth. They can't get it. OK, these niggas are still stuck on black or still stuck on Africa or, or, or whatever these niggas are into these days. They they just can't get it. All right. And it's not my fault. It, it's it's. It's really the Heavenly Father has not opened their eyes because the Heavenly Father, uh, um, through the angels, have closed a lot of our people's eyes where they won't get this truth. Where where this truth is 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 like you know you're speaking to someone in English, but in in when you speak a, when you speak this truth, it's like you're talking in a, a a foreign language. It's like you're speaking in Chinese. That's how this truth sounds to uh, the majority of Israelites out there because you know the, the, these mysteries the are you know are only given to a selected few, all right? Um, this is the book of Isaiah 6 and 9. And it reads, also, uh, I'll start eight. also I heard the voice of the Lord saying, whom shall I send and whom shall go for us? Then he said, here I am, send me. This is the prophet Isaiah. And he said, go and tell this people, hear ye indeed, but understand not. See ye indeed, but perceive not. They can hear these words we're speaking, but they don't understand them. It's not registering because a lot of these niggas, the majority of them is wicked. Two thirds of our people will be destroyed, are, are not going to get it. All right. They may understand that they're Israelite, but that, that's as far as they'll go. All right. They, you know, they, they can't get it. All right. A nation full of can't get rights, basically. All right, that that's what that two thirds is. Two thirds is a nation in their own, a nation of wicked niggas and wicked, uh, 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 wicked ass women. All right, uh, of of all the tribes. All right, he said, "Go, um, so like I read that, make the heart of this people fat, and make their ears heavy, and shut their eyes, lest they see with their eyes, and hear with their ears, and understand with, with their heart, and convert and be healed." All right, the Lord shut these people's eyes and shut their ears. All right, they have to be, convert and be healed. All right, and if the first part of that converting and being healing is repenting, all right, turning away from sin, all right? And, and a lot of our people, they, they, they it's, 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 it's simple as it is, they can't do it. Niggas can't stop eating pork. Niggas can't stop eating shrimp and shellfish. And that's easy, all right? Niggas can't stop smoking weed or, or stealing or robbing or dealing drugs 
or or, or, or trying to sleep with your neighbor's uh, um, your neighbor's wife or covenant after your neighbor's goods. These are simple things that Jake just can't do because these niggas are wicked. That's why they won't understand. That's why they can't understand why we're on the street corner prophesying and pushing this word. All right. They, 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 they scoff and say we're crazy. No, y'all are crazy ones because y'all can't get this truth. All right. You niggas is still doing the same thing you was doing 10 and 20 years ago, trying to make it in America, trying to make it in Babylon. And, and you niggas is, 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 is digging yourself a bigger hole. All right. You, 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 you always you always on an uphill battle. All right. Because you don't understand. We're under the curses. That's one thing Jay can't understand. Being under the curses. That's simple. All right. Yes, we're a cursed people. Look at us. Yes, we're a great nation uh, of, you know, uh, um, you know, great minds and, and athlete. And we're, 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 of course, we're uh, uh, the best athletes, the best this, the best that. But we're still at the bottom because we're under those curses. All right. But Jay can't understand that because these niggas is they, these niggas is wicked. All right. They're going to understand through death by pain. But a lot of these Jakes, man, they can't get it. So don't waste your time with these niggas, man. Because they won't understand. They they'll just you know they'll 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 you know okay I understand this and this and this but then when the next big thing come along when the next big uh, uh, opportunity to make it in this world or or to chase the dollar all right these niggas is gone they not they not adhering to the truth they're not being disciplined unto the truth this is Baruch chapter two and verse thirty it reads for I knew that they were it's like I. For I knew that they would not hear me because it is a stiff necked people. All right. This is stiff necked people. Jake. All right. These niggas is, is, is stiff necked, hard headed ass niggas. All right. Just so you got to stay at playing. All right. But in the land of their captivity, they shall remember themselves in two in one third is going to remember themselves in, the, in, in this captivity that we're in. All right. They're, and they're beginning to remember themselves. All right. Because because the heavenly father. Uh, uh, gave them eyes to see. All right, they, 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 the heavenly father saw something in them. All right, and 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 is and is, is, you know, using them, you know, to for his will and Lord, you know, willing they're part of the elect. Okay, but like I said, this this truth is not given to everyone. This truth is only given to a, a certain few. All right, and, and and you know, if you're able to understand this truth, you should be grateful. All right, you 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 should be you know praising your, your heavenly father. All right. The Lord opened opened up his eyes to you and the Lord, you know, found you worthy of receiving this truth because a lot of these niggas are unworthy. They're not they're not worthy of this truth. This is um, Matthew 13 and 10. And the disciples came and said unto him, speaking to Yahweh Shai, why speakest thou unto them in parables? He answered and said unto them, because it is given unto you to know the mysteries of heaven. But to them, it is not given. And these are the mysteries of heaven. We're basically telling our people a secret. All right. A mystery like, yo, listen to this. All right. We're the Israelites. Um, you know, uh, the heavenly father's name is Yahweh. His son's name is Yahweh Shai. All right. Um, you know, the Lord is coming back to destroy America uh, with chariots and and, and, and it's going to be a world war. We're, we're telling our people the good news. We're giving our people the gospel, the mysteries, telling them these these deep secrets of the heavenly father. But what are they doing? All right. They, 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 they don't take heed. They acting like, you know, this shit will never happen. It'll never come to pass. Or or the things that we speak of are, are we, we're just bugged out and loony. All right. Like, like you know, um, uh, what is this? This one time a nigga came up to the camp and said, you know, I like everything you're saying, but I just can't get with those roles. I can't get with those, the garments we had on. That's how simple niggas are. All right. That's why niggas, you know, I, you know that's why the, the Lord has got to destroy these niggas, man. Because they, they, they really don't have any understanding. Their understanding is what the white man told them, what the so-called white man told them, what, what, what black history told them, all right, what, what black culture has told these niggas, okay? That's, that's all they understand, all right? And they take that, that's their truth. This Amos 3 and 7, surely the Lord will do nothing, but re he revealeth his secrets unto his servants. The prophet, the Lord has revealed these secrets unto his servants, and the servants, the prophets are trying to reveal these secrets unto you. OK, uh, uh, unto Jake, but they, they don't want to get right. They they, they want to, like I say, they, they stuck on stupid here in America. All right. But the Lord is reviving his people. The Lord is waking up his people. The Lord is opening the eyes of his people, of his elect. All right. And sealing them with his name. All right. And with this truth. OK, but none of the wicked is going to understand. The, if you're a wicked nigga, you're not going to understand. All right. So you might as well just wait for a missile. All right. And, and um, you know, you know, live it up in America. Wait, wait for martial law. Wait for the famine. 
All right, wait for the race riots because a lot of these niggas are gonna die in, in, in these in these in these coming calamities in these coming plagues. This is the, the book of Psalms, chapter one forty six and eight. The Lord openeth the eyes of the blind, and a a our people have been blind, and some of our people are still blind. All right, they're in gross darkness, as the scripture says. Okay, but it's the Lord that opens up your eyes, not us. We're just the servants. We're just small vessels. The Lord could pick anyone to do this. It's the Lord that opens up your eyes to under, for you to get the understanding of this truth. It's the Lord that 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 is quickens you with His Spirit. All right, where you could where you where where, where you turn your life around, could do a complete one eighty and, and and stop being a wicked nigga. It's the Lord that does that. All right, the Lord opens up the eyes of the blind. The Lord raises them that are bound are bowed down. The Lord loveth the righteous, all right? So if you're righteous, the Lord loves you, all right? If you're doing righteousness, all right? But if you're wicked, the Lord hates you right now. And the Lord is going to destroy two-thirds of his people, the wicked, all right? The two-thirds of the people that of Jake that is wicked right now, right along with the wicked, Esau, Edom. Okay, so hey, don't waste your time with these niggas. They won't get it, all right? They're wicked, all right? They, 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 you know, they, they love wickedness. All right. They hate the most high. They hate Yahweh Shai. They, you know, they hate everything about this truth. So the, the, these, these jakes that you, you know, know in the world, they're not going to get it. All right. And, and let, lest they repent. All right. If, and, if, and if it's for them to get it, they'll come find the camps. All right. They'll show they're sincere. All right. But if but until then, hey, to hell with these niggas. So Lord willing, this lesson was edifying unto the elect, and I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Harakakodash. Till next time I say Shalom.